Oh, I'm so lonely. So, so lonely. Oh, I'm so lonely. So, so lonely. So, so lonely. Police, open up! Good afternoon, Mr. Paz. I'm Virginia Wolf, your lawyer. I'd like to ask you some questions, if that's all right. So, why have you been paying your bills? To Isabella too, how does the real Isabella normally spend her days? Uh, a convolvulus here, a convolvulus there, a convolvulus everywhere. It's almost like it's repetition. Isabella knows many people. She has many friends, and if someone had the audacity to open a drawer and read her letters, they would find long ones of affection, violent ones, and of jealousy, and terrible final words of party. I understand how you could be confused, but as for her letters, they were all bills. Quite situationally ironic, if you ask me. But she has gone through 20 times more posturing experience than those whose loves are trumpeted forth for all the world to hear, like Abby and Andrew Elder. No, she tore all her letters up so that she could conceal herself and her business to others. It's like a metaphor for her loneliness. Isabella, who else knew about this? You have such a large, expensive house with tons of intricate, exotic objects. There must have been someone else living there with you. No one. I, I was living by my myself. <laughs> this is impious and absurd. And your witness? How does she know what you were doing? She doesn't. She only knows what she could see. Anything out of the range of that mirror was invisible to her.
One could see a long grass path leading between banks, flowers until slicing off the angle. The gold red cut it off. Isabella, you were three million dollars in debt from living so lavishly and outside your means. If you can't come up with the money, you will go to jail. But I was just trying to fill my life with things to make up for my loneliness. I get it. I really do. But that won't work in a trial. I, I don't have the money. If I did, I would have paid the bills. Uh, I, I was hoping if I could create this life for myself, it would be enough to make me happy. If this goes to court, then the trial will seem like some acid to bite off the unessential and superficial and leave only the truth. But... What can... I... do... now? <laughs> I... I am... her... Perfectly empty. I, I guess people should not leave looking glasses hanging in their rooms. Or perhaps I should have actually looked at it. Then maybe I would have seen the truth of what I was doing wrong.